Hello everyone, and welcome to another exciting edition of Now today we're hunting for our good old buddy Pavel Datsuk once again. So O and O2 products have skyrocketed in price, even disproportionate to the rise in every product as uh, as has been happening since the pandemic first began. Um, I managed to get a hold of a box of 2001-2002 Bowman Young Stars Hockey. Gives us a chance at getting Pavel Datsuk, Ilya Kovalchuk, uh, Ilya Brizgalov rookies, among several other excellent O one O two 2 rookie class guys. So what can we potentially get inside of a box? Well, there are 24 packs. Each one guarantees, I believe, four memorabilia cards, if I'm not mistaken. Also, chance at autograph. Um, dual memorabilia is numbered out at 25. There's redemptions for autograph pucks. Let's hope we don't get that. But before we begin, don't forget to like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you feel like it. You know, I'd, I'd really appreciate it and uh, give you a high five through the computer screen if I can. And uh, don't forget to answer our viewer engagement question for today. So our viewer engagement question is a simple one, and we're focusing on 2001, 2002. Who is your favorite NHL player from the 2001-2002 NHL rookie class? This can be players who have official rookie cards that year, or guys who in the actual NHL were still eligible for the Calder Cup, or sorry, Calder Trophy, who carries over from the 001 season, who maybe didn't get that many games that year. But let me know, who's your favorite 0102 talent? Comment down below, and perhaps in the next episode of the show, I might start uh, doing a little comment shout-out portion, just to engage with you guys a little bit more. But I think that's enough of me talking. You've had enough. I've had enough of talking myself. You know what I'm about to say next? Oh, let's get ready for box breaking. All right. 0102 Bowman Young Stars Hockey. Oh, ho. All right, the Urbe bobblehead of judgment is set in his throne, ready to make final judgment on any of the hits uh, from the break. Okay, so the design, you can see black all around, and then the player in the middle with the top's young stars on the bottom. So we have Marco Sturm. Yaroslav Bednar, that is a rookie. David Legwand, second year. Ed the Eagle Belfour. Kyle Calder. Miriam Gabarik. And we have one of those thicker ones we were talking about. A little bit shinier and double the thickness. Daniel Alfredson. Super Mario Lemieux. And Pavel Bure, the Russian rocket. So these thicker ones, um, the entire base set is paralleled in it, so this also gives a chance at uh, pulling another version of a Datsuk rookie, which is cool in my box. Okay, we have Dan Kluche, Felix Potvin, Roman Chetmanek, Brad Richards, and we have one of those thick ones of Michael Pekka. Followed by Steve Sullivan and Sammy Kapanen. Next up, Sergei Samsonov. It's Marian Hosa. And stuck behind that, a rookie of Vaklav Nederost. Vaklav Nederost. Yeri Lettinen. We have one of those thick parallels of Keith Primo. Followed by Brendan Shanahan and Brian Rolston. Next up is Mark Parrish. Brendan Morrison, Jason Arnott. Yuri Dopita rookie, Yuri Dopita. And we have one of the parallels of Doug Waite. Carl Rakunik. 
and Patrick Eliash, with Martin Broder in the background. I believe this one has a memorabilia, so we'll bring that to the back. Okay, Theo Fleury, Tom Barrasso on the Hurricanes. It looks so wrong, doesn't it, when you're used to him being a Pittsburgh Penguins legend. Vincent Domfus. Hey, there we go. Rookie, Pavel Datsuk. Seems to be in pretty decent shape. A little bit of edge roughness on the right side, but hey, there you go. Pavel Datsuk. Put him in the pile. And a rookie of Jeff Jilson. Not quite Datsuk. And a rookie of Nikita Alexeyev. And behind him is Mike Comrie. Yes, authentic game-worn jersey of Mike Comrie. Urbe, what do you think of the pack with the game used jersey card and the Pavel Datsuk rookie? Oh yeah, I think the Datsuk is the winner in here. Comrie isn't the greatest, but definitely a Datsuk is why we came here and we got one. All right, we got Brendan Morrow, Keith Primo, Mark Rycroft, rookie. Cujo. We have one of the shiny ones of oh, Tom Barrasso. Craig Conroy and Bill Guerin. Okay, Nick Schultz. Nico Kapanen, rookie. Scott Hartnell. Radic Bonk. We have the parallel of Yannick Perot. We have Tony Dahlman, rookie, and Paul Correa. We have Chris Osgood, Dan Blackburn, and of course that's his rookie card, uh, Claude Lemieux. Roberto Luongo, and we have Joe Neuendijk, the parallel, Joe Sackick, and John Erskine, rookie. Okay, we have Derek Morris, Pierre Turgeon, Sergei Fedorov, there we go, also not a bad one, he was number one overall pick. Ilya Kovalchuk, rookie card. Ilya Kovalchuk. Then we have Al McKinnis, thick card. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! We got a redemption. Uh, entitles us to receive an autographed, an authentic autographed hockey puck of Miroslav Shetan, which expired in, uh, on May 30th, 2003. So, eh, we're less than 19 years overdue, so that's not, that's not so bad. <laughs> Believe it or not, a lot of these old redemptions, too, do carry some value on their own. Particularly, a person might be a big collector of Miroslav Shatan. This is, in a way, a Miroslav Shatan card. By not being redeemed, it may carry a few dollars value. I know in the past, I sold a Wayne Gretzky unredeemed redemption from before the scratch-off era, so back when you actually had to mail it in, and you couldn't actually use it for the redemption raffle. Um, sold one of those just by itself for like $118 at the time, so... Expired redemptions may have value. That's the point of this long ramble. And Milan Hayduk. It's a shame, though. Miroslav Shatan is a pretty good player. It would have been cool to get an autograph. But so far, we have our rookies of Ilya Kovalchuk and Pavel Datsuk. But before I continue, I almost forgot to ask. He, he will have his uh, revenge on me if I don't. Urbe Bobblehead of Judgment. What do you think about this pack with the autograph redemption and the Kovalchuk? Yeah, Kovalchuk obviously was the go the guy at the time. He's fallen a lot since, let's be real. And of course, expired redemption can't be used, but it's still a cool pull. Anyways, on to the next pack. Doug Waite, Vinny Le Cavalier, got Rafi Torres, rookie. Matt Sandin, Vincent Domfus. We have one of those gold parallels behind it, which is out of 250, so... Let's see whose it is after. Steve Eiserman and slow reveal of Bill Guerin. Bill Guerin. Numbered 
79 of 250. Okay, next up, Olivier Michaud, the rookie, played one game in the NHL. Timu Salani, we got a memorabilia, so we'll free it up. Okay, Mike Dunham, Patrick Waugh, there's Denis again. Okay, David Tanabe, and how are we? Okay, we have Dan Blackburn, Fabric of the Future Jersey. Dan Blackburn. So we do have one of his full game worn jerseys in our museum archives, but hey, I never complain about a card of Dan Blackburn. He was a potential 1A superstar in the works, but injuries unfortunately took care of that. Urbe, what do you think about this pack? Eh, it's okay. Blackburn is nice. Of course, there's greater potential in these boxes. We hope for a little more. But, of course, we didn't break the bank. We paid very, very little, less than $100 for this. Martin Brodeur, Alexei Kovalev, Scott Stevens, Vaclav Pletka, superstar Vaclav Pletka, yeah. Eric Lindros parallel, Mike Medano, and Ray Ferraro. Okay, Owen Nolan, Anson Carter, Kyle Calder, Danny Heatley, Ty Conklin rookie card, Brad Richards parallel, Joe Thornton, and Jeremy Roenick. Patrick Laleem, Al McInnes, Chris Pronger, Robin Regeer. We have Evgeny Nabokov, very nice. Dominic Hoshik and Alexei Yashin. Okay, Brian Sutherby rookie. He actually went to the same high school I did, though I think he graduated one year before I first started high school. So yeah, that's cool. Peter Forsberg, Christian Huselius, rookie. Timo Parsinen, rookie. We have Chris Beach, parallel. Ron Francis and Eric Daze. Eric Lindros. Brent Johnson. Christian Berglund. Michael York. Hey, there we go. Pavel Datsuk, parallel, rookie. So this one is, of course, a little bit thicker one, but hey, very nice. Pavel Datsuk. Awesome hit. Alex Mogilny and Jean-Pierre Dumont. Urbe, what do you think about this pack? Absolutely. Pavel Datsuk and tougher pull than the base version. I'll take it. Only thing that would complete this uh, hat trick here would be getting either the gold parallel or one of the jerseys or autographs of him. That would just seal the deal. Okay, we got another one. Okay. Chris Drury, Miroslav Chatin, Yannick Perro. Hey, there we go. Ilya Brezgalov. Why you have to be mad? It's only game. <laughs> All right. David Legwand, Ed Belfort. You come for the breaks, but you stay for the horrible impersonations. I know, that's exactly it. <laughs> Andy Hilbert and. We have Fabric of the Future jersey of Andrew Ferens. Andrew Ferens. Okay, Urbe, what do you think about that pack? Nah, I like Brizgalov. Andrew Ferens, uh, not, my, not my favorite, unfortunately. Okay, Peter Sikora, Adam Deadmarsh, Simone Gagne. Oh, something stuck behind it. Justin Williams, second year. We got another one of those gold versions. Rob Blake. Owen Nolan, the parallel, and let's see how we are. Got Martin Erat, gold version. Numbered 110 of 250. 
nice pearl, very condition sensitive because of the sparkly effect on it, but hey, pretty cool nonetheless. Urbe, what do you think about that pack now? Cool parallel, but Martin Erath is not the best player. Sean Burke, Radim Verbata, Alex Tange, Nick Poynton, we have Keith Kachuk, Parallel, Jocelyn Thibault, and Jeff Friesen. Too much complaining in this day and age, we just need to be happy. Saku Koivu, Andrew Ferenc, Ziggy Palfi, oh, behind that, sorry. Mark Recchi, Dan Kluche, Parallel, Byron Defoe and Radic Martinek, rookie. Evgeny Nabokov, Chris Kalanos, rookie. Rostislav Klesla, Olaf Kruzig. We have Chris Osgood, parallel. Jeff O'Neill and Jerome Ginla. Mike Fisher. Keith Kachuk, Merck Messier, Peter Bondra, Ziggy Palfi, Parallel, Roman Turek, and Nicholas Lidstrom. All right, we got Lucky Luke Robitaille, Stu Barnes, Chris Beach, Robert Lang, Tony Amante, Nicholas Hagman, rookie, and, oh, one behind it, sorry. Daniel Alfredson, and behind that is a fabric of the future jersey of Roberto Luongo. Now, no one's going to complain about a Roberto Luongo, one of the best goalies to ever play in the NHL. And definitely one of the top two best goalies to never win a Stanley Cup. And that cup final that year is definitely not his fault with the Canucks. Wasn't many goals being scored by Vancouver that year. All right, Urbe, what do you think about this pack? Eh, it's okay. Still just a regular jersey, but a good player. And the final pack of the break, my friends. Okay. Gary Roberts. Jason Allison. John LeClaire. Brian Gianta. Hey, there we go. We have Ilya Brizgalov. Ilya Brizgalov, parallel rookie, Mike Pekka, and Brett Hull. All right, so let's start off with our quick recap. So we had two gold parallels, one of Bill Guerin, one of Martin Erat, each out of 250. Not the greatest names, but still pretty cool little parallels in there. Excellent. Then we had an Andrew Ferenc game used jersey card. We had a Mike Camry, Camry jersey card. <laughs> We had a Dan Blackburn. And we had a Roberto Luongo. Followed by a redemption for an autographed hockey puck of Miroslav Shatan. 19 years expired, but hey, still a neat little hit. Then in the world of rookies, we got Ilya Kavalchuk rookie. Both a regular and parallel version of the Ilya Brizgalov rookie. And the in my opinion, best hits of the break is both the regular and parallel version rookies of Pavel Datsuk. So only question that remains now is to ask our Urbe bobblehead of judgment. Oh, great one. What did you think about this break of 0102 Bowman Young Stars Hockey? It's okay. So I'll tell you what, those Datsuks are excellent hits. The jerseys were not too bad overall. Of course, there's always potential for greater. There wasn't anything we're dancing over, but we're nothing we're disappointed over. So that's why we just say it's all right. Definitely worth the uh, the price we paid for it. Not those absurd, uh, absurd marked up prices on eBay nowadays. But I had a lot of fun. I'm glad you all tuned in and uh, joined me for this edition of Box Breaks with Bruce. Till next time, my friends. Take care of all of yourselves. Have all of yourselves an excellent day. Bye-bye.